Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Green Acres. Today I'm going to be going over an inexpensive way to make a watering tank if you need to water trees, which is in my case what I'm going to be using this for. Um, all in all, I think I'm probably going to be $25 in to and have a 55 gallon watering tank system. So I'm kind of going to walk you through the steps on that. So in terms of what you're going to need for this, you're going to need a, like a string with a weight on it in order to get your bulkhead fitting through your barrel so that you can uh, fish it out without losing it. You're also going to need an actual bulkhead fitting here and this is what my spigot's going to screw into and so basically this part is going to be on the inside of the barrel and then the outside will have this um, this part here and this should make a watertight seal. The next thing is you're going to need some type of a spigot in this case, I'm going to be using a half inch spigot um, and this is going to be something that can attach just to a typical garden hose. So you'll need that and then that is going to go into this bulkhead fitting here. Uh, so you'll screw that in and, and get that all set up. You're also going to need a drill and a hole saw bit. Uh, this one is an inch and a quarter, which I believe is going to be the right size for this project here. So you'll need that. And then in terms of the spigot, you're also going to need a little bit of Teflon tape. So with that, we should be ready to get going here. Uh, make sure and hit the subscribe button to Green Acres if you haven't already. And give me a thumbs up if you found this useful. Uh, of course, if you have any questions, comments, uh, feel free to put them down below in the comments. And, um, and then also stay tuned. I'm going to be planting some apple trees, which is why I'm making this thing. So stay tuned for getting my apple trees planted and kind of follow along with us here at Green Acres. So let's get rolling. We're just going to take this, string it through here. Drop that all down there. And for anyone who's interested, here's sort of my setup that I came up with for this. So this is just kind of a little trailer that I don't really have a lot of use for anymore now that I have my, my little John Deere 1025R. And so um, what I did here is basically, you know, put the barrel in here, obviously. I strapped it down 
with some straps here. And what I did is I just took and cut, actually I drilled a whole bunch of holes here in this top and then I just strapped it around nice and tight on there. The other thing I did is I drilled a hole in the bottom of my thing here, bottom of the trailer here, so that I can have my hose connected up here and go through here and out so that there'll be a, the, you know, the barrel will have plenty of height and pressure to, to get that water flowing out nice. Um, so that's kind of my setup here. Definitely stay tuned. I'll show you how it's working on some of my other videos when it comes to water in the trees and just um, other things that I might be using a little water for out in the field or something where I'm away from a, um, a well or a spigot and things like that. So, so yeah, thanks for watching guys. If you found this useful or anyone has any other great ideas for how they go about watering things, feel free to post them in the comments below. So make sure and subscribe to Green Acres and give me a thumbs up if you found this video useful. Thanks for watching.